Today we explore the intriguing world of the Precision Radiation Instruments Model 111 scintillation detector. Known for its unique silver gun design, this device stands out for its aesthetics and its pivotal role in the mid-20th century. But what made it so special? The Model 111 wasn't just confined to scientific endeavors. It made a memorable appearance as a prop in the original Star Trek episode, The Cage. Its futuristic design perfectly suited the sci-fi aesthetic symbolizing advanced technology and exploration. Recently, it also appeared in the new Fallout TV series, continuing its legacy in pop culture. But what made it so invaluable in real-world applications? During the Cold War, the demand for uranium surged, leading to the uranium boom. The Model 111 became an essential tool for uranium prospectors, scouring the American West for valuable ore. With its sleek, futuristic appearance, it was designed for detecting ionizing radiation. The silver gun design made it practical for field work. Unlike typical Geiger counters, which merely click in the presence of radiation, the Model 111 used a scintillator material that emitted light when exposed to ionizing particles. This light was then converted into an electrical signal, providing more accurate and sensitive readings. But there's more to its story. What set the Model 111 apart from traditional Geiger counters was its ability to measure radiation levels with greater geographical accuracy and from a considerably greater distance. This made it an invaluable tool for prospectors who needed efficient and reliable field data regarding natural uranium deposits. These attributes allowed operators to employ them while hiking on foot and from the windows of moving vehicles. In many cases, they were even used from low-flying airplanes and helicopters. Later, in the 1960s, the Model 111 and subsequent iterations even found use in nuclear weapons testing and remedial efforts involving radiological contamination. Today, it's highly collectible and cherished by both vintage tech enthusiasts and Hollywood movie prop collectors. Owning one is like holding a piece of history, a tangible connection to the uranium boom era and cinematic history. If you ever come across one of these detectors, remember its impressive journey from the knurled hands of a 1950s prospector to that of the Hollywood limelight. If you like this content and would like to see more, please subscribe and ring the bell. More videos are always on the way.